I've realized that ice is one of the most fragile material you can find on Earth. At the base of a frozen waterfall, I always feel a little nervous. Ah, oh, yes, the ice is nice here. Yeah. Maureen has reached the area where she wants to collect her first sample. OK, it? I get it. When hanging on a rope, drilling is a little more complicated. I'm always scared that I can slip uh, on my feet and then, you know, lose everything. Here, the ice is white and opaque. She thinks this could be partially down to the type of crystals. But to be sure, she'll need to test her sample later. Up. I'm going slowly. OK, look at it. Ah, good. OK, nice. Now, for the second sample. Oh, but it's not true. It's hard to get out. This is very nice. The team has reached the second sampling site, the overhanging stalactites. Oh. Yeah, good. I'm very happy. We have a big piece of it. Later, when they are safely down, Maureen sets about comparing the samples. She uses a polarizing filter that shows individual crystals. This one is really nice. Oh, that's wow. really nice. This sample from the lower part of the waterfall contains small ice crystals. This tells Maureen that the water probably froze quickly at very low temperatures. So a small grain might be coming from a fast freezing. In contrast, the sample from the highest section of the waterfall has much bigger crystals. Mm. <laughs> it's colored. Yes. What is nice is that we can really see the elongated grains. Mm. It's likely these large crystals formed slowly at temperatures only a little below freezing. What I would expect on, on something like that is that um, we had water flowing down, so at zero degree water, mm. and so it really freezed gently, so the grain could be long. Nice story. Nice. <laughs> nice. Maureen's research is helping to build a picture of how these frozen waterfalls depend upon the size and structure of tiny crystals of ice. Every one of which is shaped by the temperature at which they form. And that connection is universal. Whether it's the ice crystals that form in the frozen waterfalls of Switzerland in midwinter, <laughs> 